Hello, my name is TK. Uh, if you're seeing this face for the first time, if you're a regular, thank you so much for stopping by once again. I really appreciate the love and the support. Okay, so today I thought I should vlog. I haven't done that in a while. We have a work event today uh, at a place called Prison Break. Um, I think it's close to Kalami, between Kalami and uh, Four Ways, somewhere there. So I'm getting ready while well, I'm about to leave the house to go there. It's our end of financial year kind of event. I'm excited because we haven't done anything in over two years because of that other girl uh, called Covivi or other boy or whatever. <laughs> uh, anyway, so yeah, I'm looking forward to it. The theme is cream, and not cream, it's white and gold. So I decided to get this white pollen egg and this uh necklace i've always wanted this and you know so now i've got these kind of pieces and then i got this turban actually i was gonna i was ready to wear my wig and then i was like let me tie this up and see what happens and yeah i love this i will choose a turban or a duke if you're south african uh over a wig any day i'm just that girl so yeah that's that I'm gonna take you guys to my mirror so that you can see exactly what I'm wearing. And then I'm gonna do my best today to vlog so that you guys can, you know, be part of the party we're going to have. I hope I'll remember. Vlogging is a lot of work, yo guys. Mm -mm. Let's see. So this is the extra look. It's very easy and simple jeans with white sneakers. I'm wearing these sneakers for the first time outside. Well, I wear, usually wear them for gym. So yeah, let's see how they are outside. I hope I don't get them dirty because washing them will not be fun and then yeah obviously this pollen egg and i've already shown you this necklace that i think looks so cute and everything my makeup is also pretty glammed up lashes and all so yeah i hope it'll be great and then i'm gonna just throw this jacket on top just because it is still winter and it is quite chilly so let's go What do I do here? Oh, please wear a mask. Yes, of course, those are alcoholic and non alcoholic on the top. Beautiful. Hi. Man, you are 
to have a whole a lot of fun. Okay, so we're going to have two teams that are going to be competing against each other. So we're going to have team one and team two. Can you hear it for team one? So, let's start with the first things first. Okay, the front seats have been taken. I was a little bit worried about the lack of interest in the front seats. They are not for anyone from VIP or anything. In fact, we stand. I think he took up the to close this vlog well this part of the vlog um so yeah oh it was so much fun as you've seen it was so 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 much fun really great the place is called prison break it is basically between four ways and kailami it's an absolutely fabulous place um it's like a market i think on weekends like it's a normal market where there's places to eat and all of that then this place called dream box it's a whole i don't know 
a building that has different rooms that are like your photo shoot kind of stuff with different themes as you see that was my favorite part i spent most of the time there actually but yeah i think it's a nice place to take friends family and whatever so yeah i'll put the link below um so that you can just see that online but also what was really great was being able to meet with colleagues so many people have joined the company in the last two years and we've never seen them so it was pretty cool to be in that kind of setup and everything i really really had fun it was wonderful and yeah i just got back home about 30 minutes ago it is now yeah 20 past six so yeah it's not long that i've been home 20 minutes actually so that's that so the thing is um i'm planning to go out on saturday and maybe sunday so instead of finishing the vlog here i think i'll email i'll at the saturday and uh, sunday stuff but if nothing happens then we're gonna leave it here i'll just make sure that i have enough footage so that it is interesting because otherwise i took a lot of footage but you might not be able to see everything if i'm trying to put the other days together but yeah that's basically it and um yeah we'll see what happens there's also an event in one of my stores tomorrow sort of like an activation so i'll see if I add that to it just to give it a little bit of meat to this vlog. All right, thank you for joining me. I hope you had fun. We'll see you on to the next day. Hey babe, it's the next day. Um, so I know initially I said that I was gonna spend a few days with you guys cause I was gonna have some fun stuff to do over the weekend. But those plans have been canceled uh, because of the weather. So I figured I got some unboxing stuff. So we will do that together. But before that, I thought I'd show you my outfit looking very cute. I am most excited about wearing a lipstick today because obviously masks are off. I'll have some my days mask on and other days I will obviously just, you know, be cute. Everything is just beautiful. Okay, let's get into the unboxing. Can we take a moment to just have a look at the highlighter? Liquid Nana, the beautiful lip. Hey, hey. Just working there. All right, so why am I unboxing? So it's obviously a luxury beauty unboxing that I'm doing. We were gifted at work, um, like an end of financial year kind of gifts. They call it grab bags. We got a lot of stuff, but I'm going to show you just some of my favorites or stuff that I haven't used before that I want to share with you. Otherwise, we'll be here till tomorrow. So let's get into it. Start with this cute baby. So it's a vanity case, but inside is this diamond, <laughs> this platinum product. If you know it's to Lauda, it has levels. So, you know, levels in terms of affordability and what it can do. So there's this range that's very close to La Mer in terms of pricing and supremacy. <laughs> and it's called Renutrive. Looks like that. Let me see if you guys can see. This is showing here. So I've never used this before, obviously. So I've got the Ultimate Lift Regenerating Youth Treatment Lotion. I think it works like a serum or a toner kind of thing. I don't know. And then I've got the eye cream over here and then the, um, the cream over there. Obviously, this is a sample size, you know, so I'm looking forward to that. I've got, I've got two of these. So I'll either use the other one as a gift or I'll keep it for myself. We'll see. But basically, yeah, that's the first one. Love. Excited to see what it's going to do. Then next, uh, I've got Estelora Day Wear Multi Protection Anti Oxidant 24 Moisture Cream. Right, I'm looking forward to that. I know most of the time it's people with like a dry and oilier skin, or it's normal to combination skin, so that should be fine. I've got an SPF of 15, I will use that in the summer. So that's that. The product I've been looking forward to getting has been this Clinique um, SPF 50. Mineral sunscreen fluid for face, sensitive skin formula. And apparently this one doesn't give you the white uh, film over, over, you know, over your skin. So yeah, I'm looking forward to that. So excited. Sunscreen always, guys. You know that. Then another Clinique product that I'm really... Oh, okay, no. It's just a mascara. Okay, just a Clinique mascara. Nothing serious. Are we focusing? Oh, no, it's not. What's up? Okay, guys, not gonna fight the light. Then next, we've got a MAC lipstick. It's a red lipstick, even inside. It's part of the Viva Glam MAC AIDS Fund, if you know about that, where 100% of certain lipsticks go straight to the MAC AIDS Fund. So every year, there's a collaboration with someone, a celebrity, an artist. So this one was a collaboration with the late King Keith Herring. 
so there was different lipsticks a blue a yellow and a red which you can mix together to create whatever color and obviously we were gifted the red one which was the best choice so great great stuff next is a mac lip liner so with lip liners i like that they are so fine even though i don't do freelance makeup anymore I won't use this for my lips because I will use a lipstick straight unlike when you're freelancing and for hygiene. But for this, I can use it for a liner, you know, to give that sharp, you know, even like something of that sort. So I'm looking forward to that. What is next? Then there is a Clinique Moisture Surge. I think this is one of their best-selling moisturizer. If you've got a very dehydrated skin and you need moisture, this is the girl for you. It's got 100 hours of moisture. So good stuff uh let's see now this one i'm not going to show you guys because i've used it before and then this one is high impact easy liquid liner from clinique which i'm really looking forward to using if you've noticed my signature when it comes to makeup is liquid liner um so i think this is going to be great it's got a nice fine let's see point to it so yeah i think it's going to be cool so I'm looking forward to seeing how it works once I'm done with the liquid liner that I am wearing. So it's only probably going to be later this year that I'll get to use it. La, da, 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 da. Sorry, just want to make sure that I'm only bringing out the stuff that I want to show you guys because we don't want to be wasting time up in here. All right, let me give you the last guys. I'm going to leave the others and give you these of my favorites. Are you guys ready? <laughs> so if you've been on this uh, channel for a while, you know there is a fragrance brand that I absolutely love. I love it. So when I saw that we were gifted with these, I was so, so excited. I'm gonna start with something that I've used before, but obviously by the time I started the channel, it was finished. So now I've been gifted with this and I want to show you guys. Okay, so have a look. Jo Malone Reed Diffuser. This is the English Pear Infusion. I've got the perfume I've shown you guys before. So it comes like this and then also has that ribbon and the reeds. I'm looking forward to it. Later in the year, I'll have to open it up because I still have some diffuser in the house. One thing about my home, it smells divine. Divine. Okay. Okay, must visit. <laughs> and then the last two fragrances that i'm going to show also from the house of joe malone is this one called nectarine blossom and honey cologne how generous 100 mils guys it does smell very citrus not very it's got a fr citrus fresh smell I, I don't know how to explain it like at the first whiff it almost smells like it's not gonna sound right but you know when you've just new, newly um cut grass that freshness I know it's not an exciting smell if you imagine it with a little bit of that like nectarine you know that citrus to it and everything like that i tried it yesterday it was cool but i think i really need to wear it to feel what kind of vibe it is okay so yeah it's gonna be my spring and summer kind of fragrance but i will probably also use it during winter because what i found about the fragrances that are meant for summer or winter they really wear very well in in some uh, in 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 autumn or winter because I think then they last longer. If you know, Jo Malone scents are skin scents, so they're not meant to project hectically, especially this type with a clear uh, bottle. So um, in winter, though, they definitely last longer on my skin. I can smell myself the whole day on my body and on my clothes. So yeah, that is it. Let me show you again. I let me just read it nectarine blossom and honey the last one totally not my vibe you know because my fragrance style is very vanilla sweetish warm even a bit spicy but this girl is different I'm actually wearing her today and I think it works with the look I have today very like buzz babe so there's Jo Malone Jasmine Sambac and Marigold there we go yeah that's Kira Jasmine Sambac and Marigold how do I describe this fragrance? If you know the smell of jasmine, the plant, or flower, whatever, that's all I can answer you. 
yeah that's basically it you know at first i wasn't sure because sinuses and everything but I, because i've learned that you know i must be careful where i put my fragrances so that i don't get a bit triggered and yesterday i went to my sister and i just tried it on and she, they you know her and the kids were like you smell great and i was like mm, okay so initially i thought i was gonna give it away but now i think it's gonna warm up on me and i'm gonna enjoy it so basically that's that that's those are uh, my products that i received recently and i thought i should share with you guys maybe you want to have a look play this video and check if there's something that you would like to try out where skincare is concerned where fragrances are concerned and you know live your best life i know some of you come through the comments and it's like oh my god these are expensive stuff and everything like that well, if you can afford them, you buy them. If you don't, you don't afford them, you don't buy or you aspire and then one day you afford it if skincare is a big deal for you. You know what I'm saying? One thing I know for myself, I would likely spend money on skincare versus a lot of other things. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's weird like that. I know even back in the days while I was still working for this company, but I was not because I was working for Mac only. I wasn't that exposed to the skincare and I would buy from Clarence. Yeah, and Clarence is not cheap, but I'm that person who feels like I want to invest in beautiful skincare. Yes, now I get it for free or at a discount, but it's something that is important to me, you know. So if you are like that and you love beautiful skincare, then I've exposed you to a few products that you can check out. Anyway, that's that with the unblock and unboxing as well as um take you through to my work event. Thank you so much for sticking around until this time. I hope you're great. Remember, if you have not subscribed to my channel, I would appreciate it if you do that. We are about 30 people away from 500. It can happen so quick. Guys, help me, help me, help me. Share my work and tell people about this um, channel and um, so that we can grow together. I would really love that. So yeah, that's it. It's a gloomy day in Joburg, but whatever. Let's look beautiful. Let's keep safe. Let us just radiant, radiate you know, positivity and love and goodness and just be awesome people. Babe, I love you and I look forward to seeing you again next time.